say we won anyway. Yeah? <laughs> Listen. Adjust your TV set. No president has ever been convicted more than Donald Trump. How long before he starts bragging about this? Melania was not in court when the verdict was read, but she released a strong statement today posting about how much she loves and supports her husband no matter what the outcome of the trial was. I'm kidding, she didn't say anything. She <laughs> says that nothing at all. She was, the only thing Trump is guilty of is being the greatest president since Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> oh, not every Trump fan was looking for a fight. Some, like this guy outside a court in New York, expressed hope that we can come together to get past this. Not guilty. I hope this, the, hope the country guilty. doesn't burn down. Not guilty. I hope, I hope that Not we can guilty. find a way to love each other and to make right this this, this prostitution. Go f yourself and your mother. Well, well, that didn't last long, but in New York, that's a, it's an affectionate term. And then we have our leaders in the GOP who could not care less about Americans and how important it is that we have faith in our legal system. They know Trump is guilty. An absolute sham trial. When people here ask me what the heck is going on in your country, I am ashamed. That this is the most outrageous travesty I've ever seen. Hey, James Comer, you power. How about you subpoena Judge Mershon and his daughter? Get to the bottom of this sham trial. This is a shameful political stunt perpetrated by Joe Biden. Unbelievable. Unfreaking believable. We the people stand with Donald Trump. This will be reversed on appeal. We're doing a special podcast tonight to break it all down. Oh, we won't want to miss that. And Donald Trump is a corrupted soul. He is not capable of leading this country or leading anyone. Oh my God, I'm so happy.
Uh, those are the first 28 felony counts here as read by the jury. Mom. 29 guilty count. Thank you, sweet guilty Jesus. Guilty count. He said he wasn't going to be held accountable. Guilty. Amy, he's never been held accountable for one thing in his life. Never. Guilty. He's gotten away with murder his whole life. He's a spoiled child. It's the first time. Of course, he's going to appeal and go to the Supreme Court and they'll overthrow it. But at least he's Rachel. He, they found him guilty of something. It's a unanimous jury verdict, unanimous on all counts. This is a definitive and, um, uh, you know, he's a spoiled brat. This is an irreducible verdict. Um, he can I'll appeal. tell you what, if he'd been I'm my sure son, he he'd have had a lot of weapons. But this is everything that the prosecutor.